Hey YouTube, Wag One, welcome back to the channel. So today we're gonna go over um the Chevy Cruze. Once you have a Chevy Cruze like this, doesn't matter 2017 or uh up -huh, or 16, whichever. Once it look like this, it's the same procedure. So you come to your car, you start your car up. Um, the check engine light gonna be on, and it might give a code. It might give a code for P110 one and that's um for like the air intake and all that so it could be toting the easiest and the cheapest way to do is take off the throttle body and clean the throttle body so the easiest thing to do is take off the throttle body and clean the throttle body it can either be um the throttle body or it can be this I have a lot of, so what i normally do is just clean the throttle body that will get rid of the rough idling that go up and down so what we're gonna do now is remove the engine cover and it's gonna be a T30 torque to remove you gotta remove this bolt right here so um T30 take this out once put it put it over here so you don't lose it put it over here so you don't lose that and then we gotta um so I remove this foam and then you're gonna have access to that right there you're gonna get a flathead screwdriver to remove to remove this right here Just like that so now we're gonna have um like right there 10 millimeters you can see how dirty the tractor body is so that's why I know I always clean it when every time I get a cold for like that I always clean the tractor body because the the, the that gunk on the tractor body always cause it to add a rub and once again guys that AC comp not AC the air compressor won't let me be great to hear it come on in the background but we're gonna keep on doing what we're doing alright so this you can it's not a lot of space I already did this one time on a Malibu that take care of the problem the Malibu is a is a bigger car so you have more room to work but not on this one so I'm gonna get a 10 millimeter to take the throttle body off dirty that is so we're gonna clean it and I know I unplug it without saying anything but this is the plug you gotta pull back this gray thing right here 
and push down on it and pull that back. All right, let's move to the next part. All right, so right here, just get brakes cleaner. You can use rug or napkin, whatever you have. You just use that to clean it. you can see it's clean now you can see you have more space for the air to travel that's one of the main reasons these cars act up when idle them so guys right now we're gonna put it back Push that in. And push this. Now we just gotta plug this back in. And now we're gonna put back the. Put this back. All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and um, go do the, go clear the code and go test drive it and listen to the thing. 
all right guys so if you look right here you can see the rpm steady i don't know if i had showed it in the earlier part of the video where it go up and down and i still haven't cleared the code yet so now i'm going to go ahead and clear the code and you will see So I'm going to turn on the ignition, turn the engine off, ignition on, clear the code. And you can see the check engine light is gone. So I'm going to go ahead and drive it and all that. And guys, please go ahead, like, comment, share, subscribe to the channel. Peace out. See you next time.